Before you embark on any new idea or product, one of the first things you want to do is to get a freedom to practice. You want to conduct a freedom to practice um, analysis. You want to search to make sure that the product that you've come up with is not patented or the name of a product that you want to use for your business is not being used by someone else. Um, we have had to um, contact other companies on behalf of our clients to cease and desist using a name that our clients have trademarked. Um, a vast majority of times the other party didn't intend necessarily to use that same name. They simply didn't do a search. Um, and they've invested in marketing materials and printed and internet advertisement and, and engaged in a, a lot of resources to use that name only to have to stop. So it's very important that before you embark on any new product or name for a company that you do a search to make sure that you wouldn't be infringing on anyone else's intellectual property. I'll be talking to you about protecting your own intellectual property, but it's also important as you embark on new businesses that you don't infringe on others' intellectual property. So it's very important that you do that prior art search to see what's out there and trademark search to make sure you're not using someone's name unintentionally.